So I didn't lose faith. I had that feeling that something's gonna happen and we're gonna win. That last play, it was do or die. I knew I was catching that ball. Like, when I seen it in the air, I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna catch this. We just won a state championship, undefeated. It was just legendary. Can you put one word to describe the finish of that game? North Shore. That's two words, but it's North Shore. An iconic moment in Texas high school football. The culmination of a back and forth battle between two undefeated powerhouses that featured eight lead changes. Duncanville goes up by one with just over a minute to go. The man they call JJ puts the Panthers back in front. North Shore answers with a drive into scoring territory when a costly penalty took them out of field goal range. Holding. Offense, number 74, 10 yard penalty. And they're trying to get him settled down, knowing they've got one play left. I was like, man, I let my team down. Like, oh, it's all my fault. Some guys crying, some guys, you know, upset, screaming and yelling. I'm praying. I'm like, nah, I'm like, we not going out like this. So we still got a chance. When we got to the huddle, it wasn't, it wasn't a good huddle. They wanted to run like trick play, to do the laterals and stuff. A play named Boise. Boise is a trick play. The original plan was because of the distance, we thought that Boise would be um, more, more appropriate at the time. But, you know, it's amazing what your kids can tell you non-verbally when you're in a huddle. And the receivers were like, nah, nah. At the time, so much was going on. I was cramping and everything. Like, everybody was like, uh-uh, that ain't it. He was like, nah. That ain't gonna work. But you could see it in our kids' eyes. It was just kind of a look around, and there wasn't that sense of confidence. And then you hear Coach Gass and say, nah, let's, let's go Hail Mary. And then, you know, you, you saw that look. You saw that spark. And we practice that at the end of every practice. That's what we go to, especially during the playoffs, because you never know what kind of situation you're going to need. The main part is going to be these two guys, the point man, number one, and the outside receiver right now. This is going to be the Hail Mary that we're looking to catch. You know, reminding Demetrius to give him a chance. You know, at that point, adrenaline is racing through a 15-year-old kid's veins. So make sure that the ball is in play and then give these receivers an opportunity to either catch it or to tap it back to the trailing re receiver. I was trying to compose myself, and I took my headsets off. Raise it up, takes off his headphones, and he looks at us and he says, let's see what happens. Jordan Revels, of all kids, the defensive player, was the one smile on his face as I'm walking back to the sideline telling me. Trust the process, because I trust it. So I told him I just, I trust the process, and I feel it was going to happen. And just to hear it from one of your kids, just to kind of believe in the process, relax, focus, and let's go ball, uh, that was a special moment. Three seconds to go. Now it's down to this. As soon as I snapped the ball, I looked to not get sacked. I seen Dean come, stepped up. It was clear. I was like, oh, yes. I just threw it hard as I could. Davis going to heave it for the end zone. When the ball went up in the air, I'm looking like it's like slow motion. At first, it looked like it was going out the back of the end zone. I knew I had to catch it because it was a million dollars to me. It felt like it was worth a million dollars. And it is caught! It's caught! It's a touchdown! It's like the whole stadium like shook. And everybody just ran on top of him. I was like, oh, and I just started running too. I was like, whoa, he really just catch this? I was like, oh, I'm running on the field. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> North Shore has won the state championship on a Hail Mary on the final play of the season. Hail Mary. When their hands went up, I don't know where my helmet went. I just tossed it up, and I just ran somewhere on the field. I just ran. I ran. <laughs> I didn't know where I was going. The greatest feeling of my whole entire life. I can it's like I didn't even know what was happening. Kind of unbelievable. Like, I, I feel like it never happened. An ending so amazing that AJ broke Coach K's rule to not look up at AT&T Stadium's massive screen. I don't know what he was going to say, but I was looking at that screen now. I had to see. I looked at that screen, and I was like, ah, it's a big old screen, and I'm on it. Where does this rank in your life? Hell, Mary, from the state championship, that's number one. Number one? This is like top of the list. Like, after that play, <laughs> life's been crazy. 
athletically, I, I don't know that it gets much better than that, you know, um, in terms of just storybook endings and things that you would create for yourself. That's history right there. It's even on our rings, Hail Mary. So that's something we're going to remember forever.